Um, hello guys and welcome back to another Kingdom Hearts Dark Road video. So well it's been a long time that I haven't done any kind of Dark Road videos and I just wanted to let you know how is my progress so far. So as you can see let's go with the stats here. As you can see this is my Xehanort. Xehanort is actually level 41. I don't know if people it's much higher than this or there's people who is actually much um, you know focus on on Dark Road instead of Union Cross but in this case it's the opposite so pretty much in this case I only um, I do some you know some challenges from from Dark Road just because there are some extra jewels that you can get from there instead of Union Cross but if you want to know what is my deck or what is the cards that I have I'll let you know the following so this is actually what I actually use I actually have a Terra, a Mushu, the key art number one. This is the number one with um, number five in this case. Um, this one it's the Kinsey number four. Um, as you can see, it's a little bit upgraded. Um, Terra is a little bit upgraded as well. And we actually have Mushu that he's actually a max level. Um, what else do I have? I have the key art number three, but it's not so upgraded as well. The Donald that they actually um, gave to us. Waka just it, it just because he, he is actually much powerful, I don't know. He has 35 power, this one has 26 and doesn't have anything good, so that's why he's there. Um, healing, we actually have um, Tinkerbell, she is actually very good in healing. I have Ventus here, pretty much very cool. I have Aqua as well, Aqua is not very so upgraded, but even so she's there. I have Mini and it's maximum um, upgraded alone, as well I got Selfie because she actually has um, powerful 40, so she, she's a little bit upgraded. Um, the Kieran number 4, they gave us this on the anniversary, so that's why he's there. Um, I actually have Aerial plus 10 because Element, um, well, Blizzard is actually very good. I do have the Dark Side as well. I actually have Red Nocturne that pretty much is power powerful. Um, Queen of Hearts, just because I don't have anything much powerful than that. Um, I have Riku Replica, just because he's there. I got the Sephiroth. Sephiroth was just a surprise that I was able to get him. And the rest of them, I have the Yellow Opera. I actually have the dark side, I only need I only need another one, but he's actually very weak, so maybe I want to change it to somebody else if I have something much powerful. Captain Hook, um, Emerald Blues, actually, he's actually very good in Element Win, so anything kind of that. I have this one as well, Marluxia, it's actually very good, powerful win, elemental attack, and it provides you attack boost, that's good. Maleficent, just because I don't have anything much powerful. Uh, the Soldier, nothing uh, nothing more powerful as well. Uh, Neo Shadow, nothing more powerful as well. I have Roxas. <coughs> Roxas, <coughs> sorry. Roxas was just something like, oh my god, I just have him. And pretty much the Blue Rhapsody. So, what is the rest of my cards that I have here? As well, I have the Key Art scene number two. He's not actually very powerful, but that's why I, I don't have him here. Um, this one just actually does poison, but even so, it's just very lame. Um, I have Kyrie. Kyrie could be a bit good, just because she only provides, um, in this case, the the gauge situation. But even if you increase her level, he will she will provide you a lot of a lot of power over there. Um, playing cards, nothing very useful. It's just very low power attack. The Shadow Abu, another one of those. Genie, I think he's not very good as well, so that's why he's there. Um, and the rest of them are just normal cards. Um, King Mickey is very low. Titus, um, Alice. Alice just cures poison, but it's not very great as well. Goofy and the rest of the card ones. So, as you can see, that's the best setup that I have. I only need one more here. If I really want to add one more here, then I can just do it. But just seeing the amount of power that I have each one of them, I wouldn't actually go for them. So, that's why he is much better there and just because of the fact that there are some cards that they just um, auto automatically just do it by itself so that's why I don't actually add those so even so that it's been uh, some time that we got dark road I still have a long road to do even from the crafting situation I still need a lot of things that I need to do with crafting because there's some other things that I need to have like um, you know that I need to go ahead and do the crafting situation I need to go ahead and do some chains um, I actually need some badges a lot. I think badges is the only thing that you need so you'll be able to to craft the rest of them But even so it's actually very hard to craft so that's why I need to take myself with the crafting situation I haven't do anything about crafting just only the batch here that batch I think it's almost the everything that you need here, but I'm not concentrating on on crafting so that's the case now What do we have about um, album so in album as you can see I defeated this amount and of course I already have all the subslots and all the situation as long as you actually complete all the other ones that you know that you need to complete um, this case or this the other ones um, you'll be able to get you know power I'm sorry strength 
magic, um, HP, and magic resist, that pretty much your sand orb will be much powerful. So in this case, that you need to fill out the album, defeat all of the heartless that you can be able to get, and of course try to get this as the maximum power possible, so you'll be able to get more sub slots um, or stats, so you'll be able to defeat it. As you can see, in order to get this, you need to defeat one, ten, ten, and then a thousand, so you'll be able to get the the maximum strength. Though, so that's the case that you'll be able to get. So just defeat one. Does it be 10, defeat 100, and then defeat 1000, so you'll be able to get the sub slot, so that's pretty much cool. Uh, missions, as you can see, um, there's a lot, a lot of things that I need to do in missions, so that's no worries. And about shops, well, the only thing that I have here is just a free VIP draw. I'm not concentrating on pulling in those situations, I'm just pulling for each week. Uh, with my drop situation and on the shop points, I'm actually saving a lot of shop points, so I'll be able to buy the key art number two. The key art number two, as long as I know, I think it's the most powerful card in the game, but not so powerful because he's lacking out of power. But even so, I'm actually very curious if I want to buy the key art number two just because of the fact that it's it's not a card that you can get just because you can get it. It actually has our low rates. It does have low rates to get it, but once that you get it. It could be very, very powerful, to be honest. It could be very powerful. And even if you stack it, it will be very much powerful. So, um, I'm actually waiting to get this card. I'm pretty sure that I will be able to get this card in no time. But a thousand of shop points, it is a lot. But even so, how can you can get this card? You can only get it from the draw ticket. You cannot buy it. With jewels, you you're not going to be able to get it. But with draw tickets, you'll be able to get it. And as long as I know, if you can have it at level 10... I think that the power goes to 80, so yeah, it is very powerful. But, you know, we have much powerful um, cards now, much updated ones, and even so, maybe you can say, hey, you know what, there's much powerful cards along the way that you can actually purchase, but I'm actually just waiting to get, you know, the, the, the QR number 2, that's my biggest, biggest goal right now. And even you can go ahead and say, hey, you know what, there's some other uh, cards like I mentioned, but I really want to save for the for this card i really want it so that's why so i think that's all that i want to talk about about dark road there's nothing else that i want to talk about so just let you know a quick reminder about how is my stats how am i actually doing on dark road just to let you know how am i so pretty much that's the case guys but well that's all that i wanted to know so if everybody was curious about hey you're doing kino martin and cross content how how you're doing in dark road well that's my case and I have to concentrate and crafting and maybe and if you want to if you want me to pull for cards well i don't want to pull for cards to be honest i for me it's just something that i can get for free if i can actually buy the vip but if you think about it it's not free but well for my end it's just like hey i buy vip and they gave me draw tickets that's okay so that's where i'm pulling my cards so it's just a slow progress that it and then in the future i'm gonna be op so that's all. Hope you enjoyed this quick summary about how I'm doing in Dark Road um, for people who is actually curious about it. But I just wanted to give you the info. May your hearts be your guiding key. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace, guys.